with our chef jackets on and bandanas tied, we may look the part of professional chefs, but that may be where it ends. You guys are competing in a mystery basket, voodoo-fied competition, where you're going to be cooking for all the guests in the theater tonight. You have no clue what you're cooking, and that can be... You're right, I never know what I'm cooking. The Voodoo Foundation, led by Chef Eric Youngs, sponsored this cook-off challenge. And we support culinary scholarship for those looking to move on in the culinary world. Uh, year to date, we've given away $20,000. The foundation has also served 400 meals this year to people in need, with money raised from events like this one. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Epicurean Hotel. These wonderful people will be making a, an array of sliders. The three teams were each given a different meat for those sliders. Oh, it's, it's chicken. Brown chicken. Then we had 10 minutes to come up with our recipe. We gotta figure out what we're gonna top it with. You know, what, what, uh, what comes to your mind. You've heard of the Bloody Mary. It starts with your Bloody Mary. Okay, that long silence does not bode well for our recipe. There's Cuban bread and there's uh, King's Hawaiian rolls. Pick which one you guys like the best. Well, I typically like King's Hawaiian rolls because it only tastes good with chicken. I don't think so, right? I think the Cuban bread might be good. With our handwritten recipe ready to go, it's time to start. We chose the voodoo seasoning called magic for the chicken because it's going to be magical if all of this turns out right. After seasoning, we made the chicken patties and our third teammate, Dylan, started cooking them up. Meanwhile, Gail and I were supposed to cut up the Cuban bread, add spicy mayo to just the top of that Cuban bread. Well, the bottoms got mixed up with the tops, and the tops got mixed up with the bottoms, and next thing you know, it's just a big mayo mess. Dylan thankfully cooked the chicken sliders perfectly. We added a little onion and brown sugar relish to the top, all in just the nick of time. We were definitely the weak link. <laughs> By far the weakling. Things got hectic, time started running out. I have a whole new admiration for chefs. 